Hey, man. Oh, hey, what's up? How you doing? Up? I'm doing really well. Actually, no, I'm not doing well, you know? I'm a little tired of this place. I, I can't oh. believe we don't get paid sick leave. You know what I'm saying? No, I mean, that's borderline illegal. I've been saying that for years. Yeah, but honestly, what are you going to do about it, huh? Eh, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Hey, man, did I tell you that I recently got in trouble for making jokes? What? You're the funniest guy I know. I really appreciate you saying that, but Karen in HR says that racial humor is taboo. I've never heard that in my life. I know, man. This place, what are you going to do? Yeah, what are you going to do? You know some. I'm a little pissed off I wasn't employee of the month. Yeah, I think on some level we all were. I get that Phil saved a woman's life in the conference room. I'm all for it. I'm glad she's not dead. But I'm a triple threat. I'm good at Microsoft Word. I'm great at Microsoft Excel. And I'm perfect at everything else. That's a good point, but you know what? What are you gonna do? Yeah, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? You know, we got this Wi-Fi password. Sure, sure, TGE65321. Yeah, no one can remember that. Yeah. Why can't it just be something simple and universal? Like, I don't know, my first name. Milton. Milton. Why does my boss get to tell me what to do? What is it, part of her job description to order me around? And what, does my performance reflect upon her in the long run? And is she like looking out for my career in a benevolent way? I just don't get it. What's going on here? Yeah, and why does she make more money than me, you know? Oh, and look at her desk. Where's the picture of us? She's got pictures of a family. Would it kill her to print out a nice picture of us, put a frame around it? I don't think it would kill her. And in fact, when her children come in and visit, why don't they refer to us as dad or even papa? That would boost morale. Sure. Read a book on morale. It's chapter one. Preach, brother. Oh, I'll preach. Why does the CEO take my temperature every day before work. Would it kill him to take the back of his palm, put it on my forehead, and determine whether I'm well enough to come in that day? And would it hurt him to give me a little kiss every morning? Nothing major, just a little peck, something to make me feel adorable. Yeah, but more importantly, why aren't our offices shaped like wombs? And why are we led around like dogs by umbilical cords? I, I just don't see how this isn't happening. You know what really bugs me? Why do things happen to people in this office without me knowing about it? Nothing should happen to anybody unless I'm watching. Yeah, yeah, people shouldn't be allowed to grow or change without my permission, because I think it's about time that I get acknowledged for the god that I I am. No, not one of the historic polytheistic gods, but rather the, the one true god, a golden supernova floating across the sky. Hey, and you're both fired. Eh, hey, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? I, what are you, I, I don't know, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do for money? What am I gonna do? What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do?